my name's Joni. Welcome to my garage in India. Today we are going to paint a glass face. Um, start out with some rummy alcohol and I'm just going to pour a little bit in here, swish it around, then take a clean dry rag. You want to start with a clean dry face. Then I'm going to take a clean dry rag and just make sure it's all that the rubbing on call is all the way around. Okay. We're going to set that aside so that it can dry. We're going to then we're going to move to our paint. And what I have here is you do two parts acrylic paint to one part water. So what I have already mixed up in this glass bowl is a fourth of a cup of acrylic paint and an eighth of a cup of water. And then I've just mixed it up, just make it to where it's kind of that thin kind of soup consistency. And then uh, you will wait for your glass face to dry, you just put your alcohol in. I'm looking pretty good. So then we're just gonna drizzle it in And you can use whatever color uh, acrylic paint you'd like. I thought this would be great. You know, you can, after it dries, you can put water and flowers in it. You can put uh, tea lights, especially those battery operated tea lights. If you want to use lit candle ones, then go ahead and put a little bit of sand down in the bottom. You can do some of that decorative sand or pebbles. All right, now I'm just gonna start swishing it around. Pushing around to get the coverage that I'm looking for. And then as you get going, then you can add whatever if you need more, need less. Also, you can add more, you can do more than one color. So if you wanted to do some white in here, or just a couple colors just to get a lot of different uh, colors going on. So as you can see, just Spin it around, letting the paint run all the way through. And then when you're finished, you have, you feel like you've got all the little spots covered. Then you will just turn it over upside down on a paper plate or a paper towel and let it drain the rest of the way through completely dry and then when you're finished you will have a glass face that is colored so you can make it custom to whatever you're looking for whatever colors you want to match whatever I thought this would be pretty uh, especially as it gets closer to winter with like a big silver bow on it and maybe like a small glittery snowflake with a battery operated tea light in there I thought that would be really pretty as a centerpiece thanks so much for joining us today and what I say about this is now that's crafty. Thanks so much, and we'll see you next week on craftyjoey.com. Thanks.